Thank you to our great viewers, our 7 Action News viewers, stepping in to help a disabled veteran struggling to clean up a tree that slammed into his home. We first brought you this yesterday. Amira David has the uplifting update for us. That's right. The good news is that we got an overwhelming response from the community. Less than 24 hours, several workers on the job here working hard all in the hopes of bringing this vet some much needed relief. And yeah, we're going to get this down safe for you today, buddy. I appreciate you, man. No problem. I appreciate you. God bless you. This vet has nothing but gratitude for Robert of Rambo Tree and Shrub. He and his crew are hard at work today responding to a call for help. Jerome Macklin reached out to us after his aging backyard tree succumbed to heavy winds, splitting in half. So when I came out to look at it, it was cracking and sitting on top of the roof. It took a big fall right on top of his house, but it's only one of many occasions that this tree and others have caused major damage, putting his life at risk and leaving him to often spend nights sleeping downstairs in his living room. Best way is to stay down. I can get out the door. But thanks to our viewers, it's something he no longer has to worry about. I can sleep knowing that my house is not coming down around me. And it's not just about tree removal today. Another group, a nonprofit called Tree Musketeers, is also here, ready to take the project one step further. I'm going to fix your roof along with your siding that's been damaged from the wind and your easement on your porch. And we're going to go ahead and take care of the rest of your landscaping for you. It is great to have no to know that there are people out here that still care no matter who you are. As a minister at a Detroit area church, Macklin is often the one lending out a helping hand. But today it seems he's the one getting a little help in return. God bless you. God bless you both. Yeah, man, come on, we all can get a hug. And we do want to extend a big thank you to all of the groups that came forward. This couldn't be possible, of course, without them. And we want to remind you that if you have an issue you need our help solving, make sure to reach out to us via Facebook, email, or you can call our Call for Action Center. We want to hear from you and potentially get you some relief. For now, I'm Amira David reporting in Detroit. All right, Amira, thanks. So if you ever question if there are good people out there, there are plenty of them and uh, here's an example of people stepping up willing to help and especially those who have served our country absolutely yeah. very 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 nice and needed too by the way uh, China dealing with a 